Welcome to the first video in a tutorial series on the iCast 10 NDI Hybrid Event Switcher. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to connect the iCast 10 NDI to a computer so that we could start networking it and connect it to all the devices. Start by connecting your iCast 10 NDI to power and cycling it on. So first, we're going to connect the iCast 10 NDI to a network. Now you have two options connected to a network. The first is you can connect it to a traditional router. And the second is you can connect it to a switch. If you're going to have your NDI cameras on PoE, power of ethernet, you're going to need a PoE switch in addition to a router. So in this tutorial, let's just show you how to connect the iCast 10 NDI to your plain router that you can buy at any electronics store. Connect an ethernet cable to the LAN port that also says DVIP and NDIHX to the back of your iCast 10 NDI. Next, let's connect the iCast 10 NDI's ethernet cable into a free port on your router. When your iCast 10 NDI is finished booting up, you'll notice that the LAN connection has an address here, but to see the full address, let's press right on the menu and then press right on system and then go to network settings and then go to LAN. You want to confirm that DHCP, the dynamic IP setting, is enabled. This will have your router assign the iCast 10 NDI an IP address. And that IP address can be found right here. Enter this address into the browser of your computer or tablet to log in to the UI of the iCast 10. Our default gateway was 192.168.1.1. The default username is admin and the password is six zeros. Now you're logged into the UI of the iCast 10 NDI. Here you can assign video sources, set up your streaming encoders, record settings, streaming settings, and so much more. All right, that's how you connect the iCast 10 NDI to a computer and get into the UI. Follow us on social media to stay up to date with Data Video and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more tutorials and the latest workflows from Data Video. Thanks for watching.